Segment 5, the future of a House committee investigation of the January 6th Capitol insurrection is in doubt. It follows a move by Speaker Nancy Pelosi to ban Indiana Congressman Jim Banks and a second Republican from the panel. The Speaker released a statement around noon saying she was rejecting appointments of Banks and Ohio's Jim Jordan to the committee. She cited concerns about statements and actions from both men who are vocal supporters of former President Trump. In response, House Minority Leader Kevin McCarthy says he will pull all five of his nominees and that the GOP will conduct its own investigation. This is the people's house, not Pelosi's house. We will do our job, though. We ask to do our job. We want to do our job. She knew we would fight back against their political games, and that's why she didn't want us to participate in this committee. It just goes to show this is entirely a political exercise on her part, it's a shame. The American people deserve better. They demand answers about January 6th. Just one hour before the speaker announced her decision, News 8's Scott Sander asked Jim Banks about his appointment to the committee. It won't surprise you at all that Indiana Democrats are not pleased with your appointment in particular to this. They're quoted in a statement saying it's a partisan stunt, not one aimed to solve the domestic terrorist attack on the United States. Your answer to that? Uh, they're exactly right. This is a partisan stunt, but it's, by, uh, it's a partisan stunt by the Democrats. And uh, that's painfully obvious, I believe, to most of the American people. Democrats want to talk about January 6th. They want to beat up on Donald Trump. The chairman of this committee said yesterday that nothing is off limits. And Donald, we're going to dig into Donald Trump's responsibility for January 6th is what he said. And then, and then almost just a couple of minutes later, he told a reporter that nothing's off limits except for Nancy Pelosi. He said Speaker Pelosi is off limits. The committee is scheduled to hold its first meeting next week. We'll have more of the Jim Banks interview Sunday morning on All Indiana Politics on WISH TV.